maybe two or three years ago. I think it was at the time when she won a moment. So I did all my research and absolutely fell in love with her. For me to be called to work on this today, I jumped at the chance. It was majorly exciting for me. I hope it's something that I can continue to do more. I think she looks amazing today. She's rocked all the looks really well and really just kind of come into herself. I think we've taken her slightly out of her comfort zone, but she's welcomed it with the most open arms. Um, yeah, I just hope I'm around to watch the journey unfold. <laughs> Yolanda Brown, saxophone lady extraordinaire. Yeah, today's been good, today's been good. Started off early, I wanted to do some daylight stuff, but it might not work, because London and it's our daily daylight in London. But it's, it's still good, I've still got so many support time behind the back. I'm super efficient. Yeah. Ask, ask T, T's been commenting on how efficient we are, how organized we are. He doesn't know that we planned it this morning, but that's fine. <laughs> So we've just come to the end of my photo shoot. We've had a fantastic day. Um, wonderful team from makeup, hair, to assistants, photographers, stylists. It's been brilliant. Um, trying out some new looks, as you can see. Ever seen me with my hair up before? Um, and it, yeah, it feels good. It's, um, it's nice with a photo shoot. You can just create a new world, create a new feeling. Um, and then the next photo shoot might be something totally different. So it's exciting. I've had a good day playing dress up. Um, for my work <laughs> but um, I hope you like the new images when they come out you'll see them on promotions everywhere now we're all done off to an interview at the BBC we've got to change first Guitar Ed and Fermi on a cajon. A cajon? I have a cajon. You have? I can't play it, but I can sit on it. I was going to say, I'm going to get you in on it. Here on the Robert Elm Show on BBC London. I got all nervous then because the person I was about to talk to ran away. I mean, I often have that effect on young ladies, but it's. Not usually quite as suddenly as that, but she's back, I'm very glad to say. And I'd like to welcome Yolanda Brown indeed back to the show. Yolanda, welcome. Thank you so much. I'm glad to be here. Yes, no, I'm not running away from you. <laughs> and I'm trying to when that work out when I f you first came in. It would have been four or five years ago, it I It was indeed. Were you always going to be a musician? Probably, deep down, yes. Um, I really enjoyed, well... I initially enjoyed motor racing. As, as you spoke about. <laughs> really? So you're going to be a racing car driver? I really wanted to be a Formula 3 racing Did you? driver. That was the dream. Wow. Um, and it's only through music, actually, I'm getting a chance to to meet people in the racing industry wow. and race. So I am racing now. Are you racing really? at the moment. Fantastic. I'm working my way up to single seaters. God, this um, is one tough girl. Isn't it? <laughs> I wish I. And you are very much a live performer, aren't you? For me, live is it. Um, we're in the middle of a rehearsal at the moment. I just left the rest of the band um, at the rehearsal and we've come to see you. So I really enjoy playing and making music live with wonderful musicians. Um, yeah, the studio is a bit different for me, you know, just playing in a box to a green light. I love live recordings and, and live performances. Well, but you must have another record come due out soon, mustn't we you? We are, yes. We've um, just come off tour. We were touring Jamaica and um, America and we had some... Um, How does that, taking jazz to America? It or was brilliant. It, yeah. was, it was nerve-wracking at first because that's where it originates from, of course. Of course. Um, but we sold out all our shows in Rochester really? at the Rochester Jazz brilliant. Festival and it was a really warm sort of reception and we can't make 
wait to get back there again. And you're playing live this coming Friday up at Boys Day. I am, yeah. This is our first tour date back on, on the road. Is it? And a, yeah. a London gig? <laughs> and a London gig, yeah, just up the A13. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we'll be at Boys Day on Friday. I'm really looking forward to it. Rehearsals have been good. <laughs> Fantastic live saxophone there from the brilliant Yolanda. Oh, it was nice, really nice to do it acoustic actually. It has a bit of a different twist, so um, yeah, really good. And Robert Arms has been a great support um, throughout uh, the whole career, and so it's nice to be launching it back with him again. So, yeah, back to rehearsal. <laughs> Starts all starts in two days' time, so we've been here going over the old material. It's coming back, it's coming back, it's in the fingers, it's in the fingers. No, no, it was always there, but um, yes, enjoying um, just making music for me, rehearsals and live is the best part of what we do. So I'm having a good time, it's good to see the guys, and we're looking forward to being on the road again. So make sure you catch a date, We've got some things cooking. We're sold out, which is great. Hey, no. <laughs>